Hey everybody, it's Peggy, and today I've got another Timu haul. I've got lots of goodies in this bag. Let's open it up and see what we got. Well, hey guys, it's Peggy, and we have a nice big Timu haul today. Let's open it up and see what we got. We've got some clothing. Okay, I, <laughs> I must have really liked this style because this is the third one that I've bought in this style. So, I like the black. All right, so we got this cute little black shirt that I've purchased in two other colors, which tells me I must really like this style and it looked good in the photo. And it is a good shirt. The first one I got was kind of a, was supposed to be pink, but it was more like a very soft coral. The other one I got was white, which was perfect. And this one is obviously black and it's perfect. So I like it okay. What else do we have in here? What we got here is a pre-makeup gel base. Do that on that one. I don't know if you can see it. Okay, let's just try a little dab on my skin. Well, actually it feels pretty good. It uh, doesn't really leave a sticky feeling or anything. Doesn't really have much of a smell, so this might be nice. What else, well, we've got stuff that's just trying to fall out at like smooshed box, but that's so far I haven't had anything. Oh, I've been wanting this. Uh, haven't got anything that was damaged, I don't think. These are glasses that fold <laughs> they're definitely not attractive by any means and they're kind of weird but somehow oh you flip uh, like that I guess take my glasses off so when I put on my mascara and my makeup let's see <laughs> they're not pretty but that way I can do my mascara and see out of one eye. Uh, yeah, so you could just flip it up. Kind of look like Mr. Magoo. You're probably not old enough to remember Mr. Magoo, but uh, this might work. Might be in the way, might be kind of hard, but I was thinking that they were going to be, I saw ones that kind of like I don't know, they folded differently. But I'm curious to see how they work because when I put on my mascara today, boy, did I smudge that stuff all over the place. So it'll be nice to have something that will help with that because it's hard to do when you can't see nothing. All right, what else do we have? What is this? Oh, they're blackhead strips. I don't get too many of them, but I wanted to try them. What I do get is really dry in these corners, but I found a solution to that, by the way. Um, and most of you know I'm a soap maker, and I make lots of other products too. However, I do make lip balms. I did make lip balms, but I'm probably not going to do them anymore. But I have some lip balm, and I thought, well, that would be an easy thing to just use the lip balm tube and you don't even have to touch it and I've been doing it for the last three days and I don't have dry nose and I smell bubble gum so <laughs> so anyway that was a little side thought sorry about that so I don't get a lot of them but I do tend to get some on the tip of my nose so I thought these might be fun to try I wish they were not black though so you could actually see if you were pulling any uh, blackheads off but because you know everybody wants to see that see if it's working so that's the only complaint I got about that without trying it okay what is this okay this is a little purse so like if I actually want to go out and do something fun and exciting which I don't do very often that I can take this little purse 
It's got a little zipper on the outside. This seems really well made. This is better than any Timu purse that I bought. I like the feel. It's got lots of little zippers. The zippers are strong. Um, the inside is made well. It's got another zipper. It's uh, you've got a pocket here, and it's got the little zipper thing here, and then you got another space. Then you have another zipper here, a zipper on that side, a zipper on this side, and it comes with a strap. So you know what? And uh, or you can have just use it as like a a wristlet kind of thing. So I am impressed with this one. I don't remember if it had other colors, but black goes with everything, so I chose black. So this one I am very impressed with. Okay. What do we have now? What is this? Get off me. Oh, okay. I was like, what is this? I didn't buy anything that looked like that. But it's a little um, nail set. So you got a little scissors and um, a little, little emery board, um, some, some weird kind of clippers, which I've never seen. They're very tight in here. I'm not sure I've ever seen clippers. I don't know if you're going to be able to see that. Uh, that have this kind of tip on it. So that's interesting. It might come in handy. But anyway, it's got several little tools. Another um, regular nail clipper. Um, like a little tool to get the gunk out of your underneath your fingers and a pair of tweezers. And it comes in a little handy bag. So like if you're traveling or whatever, you could take it with you. And it has a snap. So that's all right. Eh. Well, right now, it is Naked 12 color eyeshadow, but I'm having a heck of a time getting it out. I don't want to ruin the box. Come on, Peggy. You can do it. There we go. All right. So, out of the box. Sorry, my kitchen light is shining on stuff. Um, I like that it has a little liner so it doesn't get all over. It has double-ended little brush and I don't know the colors seem all right so I'm gonna have to try it. Let's just let's see let's just try one color. Do it so you guys can see. So, it does show. I mean, that was just two little strokes on my hand. Excuse the bruise underneath it. Um, but it seems fine to me. So, I think it was pretty cheap. And that way I have some colors to wear. Okay, yay. I always wear, well, I like to wear aprons when I sew because I tend to, like, sometimes oil will splash and ruin my shirts and stuff. So I bought a couple of them, and I can't remember if I bought them off of Shein or Timu, but they were so cheap. It felt like cheap, really thin burlap sacks and... I wore it one time and washed it and the straps broke off so I had to sew them back anyway and they were cute but this one is a lot more sturdy and I like the fact that it has pockets on it. So let's see if I can scoot back. So yeah. See pockets, pockets. This will be perfect. Exactly what I needed. I needed the pockets. The other ones I have don't have pockets. This isn't as cute as the other one, but... Oh, I, I know what it is. Yes, it's it's one USB cord, but it has three different tips to it. I don't really want to open it. Sorry, guys. 
it has three different tips so that way I wasn't sure I, actually I bought this for my other camera because the cord on that one the I've had that camera for like 15 years and it's loose so I have to keep jiggling it so hopefully this will work because it has three different tips on it more shorts boy I don't know what I was thinking but I have shorts right now oh no it's enough <laughs> okay this is the same material as those um, kind of salmony colored ones which were supposed to be pink um, I got they are comfortable though so they're great for lounging around. I was worried that the material would make you sweat, but I can say from experience because I wore the other ones a couple times and I did not sweat, even when it was hot. So these are a win. This one I have been waiting for, and please tell me it's not cheap. It's also kind of large, but I, not too, too large. This one, I love this color. See, it's so pretty. It's got such a pretty color. The material's okay. Zipper's okay. All right, so this one can be a handbag or you can use the strap. And I'm not sure what this is for. It's a little decoration. It says Yoel, I think, or V O E L, something like that. Um, Padding out. So you see, inside is spacious. You have a pocket on the side. Again, it's that weird material, but it's it's stronger than the other one I had. You've got um, little pockets here. She put stuff, so you have a pocket there. Then you have the zippered pocket in the middle. And then you have another pocket here, and you have another little zippered pocket on the back that you can put little things. You have a zipper, zipper on the outside. Oh. So I think this is a win. I think it's cute. It's definitely, I love this color. It's kind of a salmony pink ish color, but I like it. Boy, I really did get a lot of stuff on this haul. Okay, what are these? Doesn't some kind of scrubber? I am going to. I think these are body scrubbers for like exfoliating. It's got a soft part there. These actually might work good for washing. And since I'm a soap maker, you know, I got lots of soap to try it out with. Uh, so who knows? I'll have to let you know when I try them. It doesn't feel like it'll rip my skin off. Well, I think once it gets wet, it'll be a little softer, but good for exfoliating. Okay. What else? Oh, I've been needing these. These are just, hopefully they're the size that I need and I didn't get the same small one, but I did. I got the same small one. Gosh darn it. I was thinking these were bigger. I got some of these in red last time. Maybe they are big and they're just folded. But no, oh my God, they're even smaller. <laughs> well, I use these for pet waste cleaning up the cat box and I gave some to my son take when he takes the dog out for a walk. But I was thinking I was getting bigger like like grocery size bags because I can never have enough of those. Um, I got this because I have a new car. Well it's 2022 and I'm not kidding. The the first week that I got the car some bleep 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 jerk uh i'm just gonna say it some asked hard 
it must have been at the grocery store, scratched the whole front side of my car door and the back side of my car door. I went and bought some kind of creamy stuff and it didn't, didn't do anything so I'm desperate. I forgot to, next time I go to my car dealership I'll have them see if they can buff that out but that just pissed me off. I mean I only had the car a week. Why? So anyway it's a scratch clean cloth removes all kinds of lacquer finishes such as Small scratches, stubborn stains, mosquito corpses, oxide layers, etc. You get two pieces, so whatever. It wasn't very expensive. Thought I'd give it a try. Probably won't work, but we'll see. They covered up what it is, so I can't see what it is. They put a sticker on it. Oh, okay. This is eyeshadow. Oh, okay, I think this is that. I thought this was interesting. Okay, it's, let's see. It's Lamelia Color Eyeshadow. And I thought it was kind of interesting. I don't know if it's showing up. But it has two colors. Still don't know if it's showing up. And so, like, you can just, we'll see how it works. But it was cheap, and I thought, what a fun idea. This, okay, I know I didn't. Oh, okay, maybe I did. I used to have glasses that had the um, sunblock filter thing built in the glasses, but I don't anymore. So I thought, well, why not? They have these glasses that go over your glasses so you can still see they're not the prettiest thing ever but sometimes when I'm driving around and it's too bright I'm like oh, I can't see I kind of look like uh, these <laughs> but you know what who cares if I can see then it's worth it so that way I can still wear my glasses and see to drive and block out the sun so and it comes in a little case which is also nice. <coughs> Excuse me. And it has a little handle. Okay, I must have got... Oh, I think I got one for me and one for my son. Another one of the um, nail sets. I got the peachy pink color for me and the gray one for my son. Okay, or actually it was blue, blue one. And I got another one of those cables so that way I can try it on both of my cameras. But anyway, here is a pair of shorts I've been really excited about getting. And I like the material. It feels good. It's comfy looking and, but good enough looking to go out in them. So I like it. All right. I'm going quickly because I've got just a few more and I don't want my battery to die again. Um, this... Oh, oh, you get two. It's hair towel wraps and I've never used one of these but I thought it might be interesting to try. So you get two of them. There's a little hood. I'll have to look and it's got a little button there and a little thing to hook the button on but I thought, you know, I'll give it a try. It seems like it'll be, it's very soft and it'll probably be absorbent. And then you got another one in just plain gray. So I'll have to try that. I've never used one and hopefully it'll work out. All right. Oh, okay. I know what this is. This says it's a contour cream. I looked at it and thought, well, that's interesting. I've never seen anything like it. So, um, three contour color isolation, and it has some Japanese writing on it, but it looks interesting. So, we'll give it a try. Let's see. Okay. So it comes out like that. I'm 
don't think it's going to put much color. Um, feels Oh, but it feels so very good. This is going to be like, I'm going to put this on before I put my makeup on because it's going to, it has a nice smooth feel. I like it. This is Loose Powder. Kilfe, K-I-L-L-F-E. Loose powder, if I can get the plastic off of it. Excuse, I took a sip and it dribbled down my shirt, so don't look at that. <laughs> um, okay, we got some loose powder. I needed that because the, the other loose powder I got, I didn't really care for. It just comes with a nice little sponge and it's got a protector on it so I'm not going to go through all that but it looks like it's going to be the right color the other one I got was too pale so this looks good why did I buy this oh I bought it. Why did I buy that? I don't recall buying this. I know I had, oh sorry, you can't see. It's a rug, a very big one. It's all right. Um, I did buy ones um, that matched my shower curtain and my wall hangings, if you remember another video. And it's like foam and it has this slip guard in it, which is fine, but um, my nephew came and spent the night and when he got out of the shower, the whole thing was soaked, and and so uh, I was just afraid it was going to like mold all over the floor. So I don't really dig the rugs. I don't think I'll buy any more, and I honestly, truly do not remember ordering this rug, because I would have bought two. So, anyway, that's everything. I hope you enjoyed the video, and... Uh, Please remember to like and subscribe. I appreciate it. Thank you guys so much.